Hello, welcome to the US Visa Success Series video 21. My name is Richard Lasrado. I'm an MBA with 22 years of study abroad past experience. In this video, I am going to talk about your relatives who are in US. Do you have any relatives in US? Yes? How do you answer them those questions? Are you afraid that your relatives in US could lead to your visa refusal? So this video will help you to answer those questions. Also important is if you have visa doubts, book the calendar appointment. The description link is given in the, the link is given in the description. And if you have study abroad queries, you can use the same link to book an appointment. The first appointment is free, so take the advantage. And I would be personally be there to have your study abroad counseling query answered or your visa query answered. So let's start with today's questions. Do you have any relatives in US? Yes. What are they doing? So they are working or they are basically resident. What are they doing? On what visa they are? They are on work visa, they are on a resident, they are already a resident, a green card holder. When did they went to US? So you have to tell them, on what visa did they go to US? So they went on a student visa or any other visa, okay? Why have you selected a university which is close to where your relative is staying? This is important because when you're selecting the university, you should select university, which is good. When you are selecting a university, which is close to your relative, the visa officer feels that you have selected a university just because your brother or sister is staying. Let me clear here, here the relative means your parents, which is your mother, father, brother, and sister, your cousins, your distant relatives, are not considered here. Everybody has some uncle or auntie in US, but how close or how far they are, I don't know, but everybody may be having some, or even if everybody not have, most of them have. So here, when you are talking about relative, I'm talking about your parents, your brother or sister. So if your parents or brother or sister is in US, then basically these questions are important for you. So why have you selected the university which is close to where your brother is or sister is? Or, or, so you have to be very careful when you're answering this because uh, the visa officer can reject you saying that you are a potential immigrant. You have selected a university which is closer to where your brother, sister, parents, and you are not a serious student. Because there is a strong tie that you have shown when you have shown that you have basically a relative in US. So your chance of coming back is less. So be very careful, select basically more universities at different locations. Try to get scholarships to prove that you are a genuine student. You know, all these are very important to convince the visa officer to grant you US visa. So if you have relatives, see that you carry the documents of your relatives. That is, their passport copy, or their PR, or, or if they are studying, then the, or the transcripts to show that they are genuinely doing what they are doing and to prove that you are also a genuine student and you want to study and come back to India. It's difficult when you have relatives, but it's not impossible. You, there are students who have got visas and if you prepare yourself well, if you are able to convince the visa officer, then you too have a chance of getting visa. I hope all this series is helping you out, clearing your doubts, making things easy for you, and helping you to get your US visa. All my best wishes are with you. Take care. Bye.